Hello to Piper and Presley and Blake. This is Grandpa, and I'm here today to read you a story. And the story we're going to read is called Mr. Brown Can Moo. Can you? So let's turn to the first page in our book, and it says, Oh, the wonderful sounds Mr. Brown can do. He can sound like a cow. He can go moo, moo. Can you go moo? Moo. Let me hear you now. Ready? Moo. Oh, that was good. You're mooing really, really good. Let's go back to our book now. The next page says, He can sound like a bee. Mr. Brown can buzz, buzz like a bee. How about you? Can you go buzz, buzz? Let me hear you. Can you go buzz, buzz like a bee? Bzz, bzz. Very, very good. That was a good bee. Let's see what's next. He can sound like a cork. Let's over here on this page. He can sound like a cork. And here's what a cork sounds like. You put your finger in your mouth and go. Can you do that? Let me hear you. That was good. He can sound like horse feet. Clop, 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 clop. I like to do it on the table. Can you do that? Very, very good. The next set page says, this is a fun one. It says, he can sound like a rooster. Can you sound like a rooster? Cock a doodle doo. That's how I do a rooster. Let me hear you do a rooster now, okay? Good rooster sounds. You guys are really, really good at making these animal sounds. He can sound like an owl. Mr. Brown can do it. How about you? What does an owl say? You guys are really good at this. Oh, this is a fun one. He can sound like the rain. And it says in the book, dibble, 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 dop. And I don't know why that sounds like rain, because that's not what rain sounds like. Here's what rain sounds like to me. Can you make the sound of rain? That sounds pretty good. You guys did really good on that one. Okay, let's see what's next. He can sound like a clock. Tick tock, tick tock. He can tick and he can talk. Can you sound like a clock? Tick tock, tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. Let me hear you. Well, that's good. Oh, this is a good one. He can sound like a hand on a door. Can you make a sound like a hand on a door? Come in. Try it. You have to find a table. Come in. Okay. Ooh. Boom, boom, boom. Mr. Brown is a wonder. Boom, boom, boom. Mr. Brown makes thunder. He makes lightning. Splat, splat, splat. And it's very, very hard to make a noise like that. Well, I can teach you how to make a lightning noise. You just go like this. Can you do it? Let me hear you. Oh, that was really, really, really good. Okay, let's check out the end of the book here. Mr. Brown, whoops, we gotta get rid of our lightning. Bye, lightning. Mr. Brown can whisper very soft whisper very soft and high like the soft soft whisper 
of a butterfly. Maybe you think you can too. I think you ought to try. Can you whisper like a butterfly? Whisper, whisper, whisper. All right. Oh, the wonderful sounds Mr. Brown can do. Why don't you try to do them too? Turn the page and let's review. This is all the sounds. Are you ready? Let's start with the cow. Ready? The first one's a cow. Moo, moo. Then the bee. Bzz, bzz. Then the pop. Then the horse. Clop, 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 clop. Then the rooster. Cock a doodle doo. Then the owl. Hoo, hoo. Then the rain. Then the clock. Tick tock. Then somebody knocking on the door. Then some them some lightning. <laughs> Last a whisper. Can you whisper? And that is that. That's the story of Mr. Brown. Grandpa is going goodbye now.